Hello, we got five people. Yay! One, two, three, four, five. Hey! Okay, cool. Is this the school? Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right. Thank you for helping me out and watch my presentation, guys. My pr my presentation is going to be on should the NCAA student athletes um, be paid for their them playing sports? Yes, I I seen this on NPR. Okay. All right. Cool. Um, so my name is Paul Burnett, and this is for Speech 101 class. Um, and has anybody ever watched a national championship game on TV? I've gone to a college sports game. Yes, sir. Yeah. Okay, so great. Uh, so those. Obviously, that the marketing involved, there's a lot of dollar bills exchanged hands, and then it's at the players' expense as well, because they're the actors, they're the performers, they're the, the workers in the situation, yeah. and they're really not getting paid for their time and their services. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, so, the topics that we're going to talk about are the revenue that, that's created, all the dollar bills, like I said, with all the jersey sales, the ticket sales, concession sales, all that stuff, um, the injuries that are involved. Uh, the risk that they're taking. We got an injury here. Might have been from sports. Um, all right, then we also have the, the pros and the cons from, uh, from each of these things as well. All right, moving forward. All right, so revenue. There are 27 schools that make $100 million a year from college sports. That's crazy to me, right? Yeah. And then these players, these student athletes, are Probably making more than that. zero, right. Yeah. But yeah, this, this data is just from uh, last year, so. Yeah, it's probably a little bit more up there. Yeah. yeah, so 27 schools are making over $100 million from these. Does that count athletes. their uh, uh, donation? Air, yeah. Air time um, and stuff? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. yeah, that's so just so yeah. Yeah. Right, right, all right. So, uh, so the University of Texas, they made $182 million last year. <laughs> that's just one school <laughs> See, off these guys. They're, they're not paying these athletes. I mean, they're paying the coaching, the coaching staff. Um, so that's a 21% increase over 2017. So that's that's pretty wild. That's just and then uh, all right. So and then 120 million dollars of this is made from football. So that's like the, their their main wheelhouse. And that's Texas. They and suck then, at football. Yeah, but it's, it's, it's the marketing though. And then we got uh, 16 million dollars is made yeah. from men's basketball. Is that and then uh, or Texas? Uh, Texas Longhorns. Longhorns. Right. And then uh, 1.8 million is for the women's basketball. So. And you can see $182 million made from this one sport, this one college university op option of athletics. Did they say one point um, And anything? they're jacking up the price of school every year? Yeah, ab absolutely. <laughs> right, and tuition. Cool. And then you got uh, the, t the television deals. For instance, Notre Dame, they have a $15 million annual contract with NBC just to televise their games. So there's a lot of money being taken place. And then these students are risking their, their bodies for, the, for these organizations and these uh, universities. Um, at, has anybody seen the Zion Williams oh, yeah. injury? He so yeah, so the, and yeah, so the and shoe Nike exploded. Him so <laughs> exactly. So imagine if this was like a torn ACL, he would have some nerve damage, and then his mm -hmm. career is over, and he's playing for free. So that's that's kind of what I'm kind of opening up some eyes. And we also have another um, example of Jake Butt. He is a uh, he's a Michigan tight end, and he blew his ACL in the championship game. Mm -hmm. um, so he uh, you know he blew his um, ACL. And he actually had uh, insurance policy, so he got drafted in the fifth round. He was going to be a top ten pick, mm -hmm. but since he blew out his ACL he, in the championship game, the last game of the season, he kind of blew that. So he was actually a fifth round pick, and with his insurance policy that he took out, uh, he was awarded five hundred forty three uh, thousand dollars because that was the discrepancy kid. with uh, yeah. So that's very smart. Smart um, kid. So like I said, these smart kids are risking kid. their lives, their their bodies, um, their time, everything. All right, so then you got your pros. Um, it can make college sports more lucrative if you're paying the players. They might, you know, yeah. uh, make it more exciting for the fans and whatever. Um, they might exact actually uh, complete their education, so they have something to fall back on if there is an injury. Um, also, they, they don't have to rush to go professional because, uh, you know, they can still provide for their families while they're in college. They don't have to, you know, do one and done and go straight to the to the pros. So if they hurt themselves, they, then, they don't get a full ride. Question. I'll do the questions at the end. Okay. Cool. All right. Cool. And then uh, it it can also level the playing field if they do get paid. Um, as far as like Duke, how they get the top three recruits in the nation, Always. and then they you know they win a lot. So and then uh, and the individual marketing as well. So the the cons is uh, like I said the finances. So a lot of schools can't pay for all these players. So like your bigger schools, like your Dukes and Alabama, they'll have more money to spend mm -hmm. for uh, for better.
better players. Um, and then it, it would also um, eliminate other sports. Like they might uh, get rid of the baseball team, make room for more salaries at the, the, at the football, you know, because that's, that's the wheelhouse. Um, and then just to wrap things up right now, uh, we talked about the revenue, the injuries, and the pros and the cons. Um, and then do you guys think that uh, players should get paid or not? Yes. Yes? yes I am. Every one of them? Absolutely, yeah, because eighty right. percent of those kids aren't going to the pros. No, that's correct. So they do all that for nothing and just school glory and all right. that hoopla stuff. But okay. they go and to practice every day. I, I, I just got a pan real quick. Okay. Right, cool. but, we uh, got? We're still here. We got five. They didn't leave. I was. I didn't bore them.